It's me, Rab. I need a wee word with you. Can I come in? Just you in here, eh, laddie? I was hoping to speak to your pals, too. Could you ask them to join us? It's Jade. The lass here was fighting within the tournament. She's missing. I've looked all over town, but she's nowhere to be found. I can't help but worry she's got herself caught up in something. Will you help an old man look for his wee friend? So guess who just remembered that they uh, didn't plug in their microphone? Oh boy, I know what I'm doing. So, uh... I'll go ahead and uh, give the uh, intro again. Hey there, folks. As far as you're concerned, my name is Freak with a Pen, and um, this is the new Tuesday stream, and we're continuing our playthrough of uh, Dragon Quest XI. Uh, Evan Prutit joined. Charlie Stewart joined. Welcome. Welcome, folks. Welcome. Uh, I'm a fool. You're a star. With yourself and your pals here to help, I'm sure we'll find her in no time. Right. The last place anyone saw I swear to God, every time I, he talks, I hear the Scotsman from Samurai bridge, Jack. Boy. How long have I been playing and I just didn't have... Okay, like five minutes. It's fine. Got my midnight coffee here. Good midnight coffee. What do you want me to do? Jade has gone missing. Start by searching near the orphanage in Octagonia. <laughs> I love Rob's an run animation. Oh, come on, really? You're not gonna give me an animation for him climbing? Oh, that would have been great. <sighs> Fine game, ruin all my fun. This is the... This is the orphanage, right? I think it's the orphanage. Yeah, no, it's the orphanage. Oh! This is bad, Mr. Freak. No, wait, what did I decide these people were again? I genuinely can't remember what I decided the... the I'll go, I'll go with the regular old Cockney. This is bad, Mr. Freak. This is real bad. Uncle Vince ain't here. He's meant to be sleeping, but he's gone. And something super weird. 
happening. Some simple weird's happening in the garden downstairs too. Thank you, small child, for letting me know exactly where I'm supposed to go. Hey, welcome, people in chat. How's it going? Good to be joined. Welcome. Edgar Bronson joined. Welcome. Jonathan joined from the shorts. Welcome. Mr. Freak, you got to listen. When he, when we realized Uncle Vince was missing. He searched the orphanage high and low, but all we found was this. It's a staircase leading underground. None of us have seen it before. Do you think he might have gone down there? Where do you think it leads? I don't know. I guess I'll go check it out. Not like I got anything better to do. So sit here and sip my coffee. Something like hazelnut honey drizzle. It's good. D stuck joined. Welcome. Welcome, people in chat. Welcome. Let me know how y'all doing tonight. Hatcha! A group of Dracolites. God, I made a poor choice in, uh, in cup. I wanted a big cup of coffee, and the only big cups we had were these, uh, thin plastic ones. Like, it's not, you know, so thin that it'll... that it'll melt, but it's thin enough that I'm... that I do feel the heat from the drink. God! Damn, Toomerang is good! Knife, what does that mean? Free Palestine, destroy Israel, joined. Welcome. I don't like getting political on my stream, so I will not comment. Whatever you think it means, baby. <laughs> Joshua Hone joined. Welcome. What, didn't we just kill the Dracolite? Fuck it. Eh, eh. I wonder what could possibly be in... I wonder what could possibly be in this cave. I'm sure this isn't a clue at all. Ooh, shiny. No, Serena, I wasn't trying to talk to you. No, I wasn't trying to shoot the thing. Climb, damn you. There's shinies here, for God's sakes, man! Free spider webs, yeah. Were the Dracolites dancing just now? Oh, that's cute. Uh, anyway, let's kill this zombie. Let's do this. Ah, you dick. How about you suck on these? It's such a good attack. As is Bang. Bang's pretty good. I can't say Bub. You can't say Bub? As in the thing that Wolverine says? Nuke World 3 joined. Welcome. Why would it censor Bub? That's weird. <gasps> Milo! Hi, Milo. You been a good boy, Milo? Say hi to the peoples? Or do you just want to lick butter off of a plate that happens to be in my room? Yeah, it seems like you just want to lick butter off the plate that happens to be in my room. 
uh, same reason it's censored. The same reason it's censored. Whip? What? What? Hey, Luffy! How's it going? <clears throat> Can't wait for tomorrow. I finally got to... Uh, some... I finally got to... Uh... How about you? Um... You know what? Today has been, uh, today's been okay. Um, I got, uh, I finally got, uh, Nintendo working on my Wii. So, tomorrow, we'll be playing some, uh, GameCube games. And I'll be adding GameCube games to the, uh, games people can request, can, uh, request for adding to the Wheel of Wednesday. So that's cool. really hoping that we're just gonna do more damage. Yep. Sweet, you can play Twin Snake. Why do you keep trying to make me play Metal Gear Solid games, Knife? I'm not good at them. You're good at them. You already knew what I was gonna say. Do you have Valorant? Um... I think so? Practice! Bro, several of the games that I am doing for, you know, extended, uh, that I'm doing whole playthroughs of are RPGs, which means I have to grind. Hey, Rock, how's it going? Did so much damage. Oh, uh, hey, when did you start? Uh, a few minutes, uh, a few minutes ago. Uh, unfortunately, I, uh, didn't have my mic plugged in for, like, the first five minutes of the stream, so. You know, I'm an idiot. Uh, okay, okay, how about Super Mario Sunshine? I never played that. Actually, I'd be super down for playing Super Mario Sunshine. Uh, eh. um, but what I'm hoping to do tomorrow is play this game called... Okay, you should have sent... Oh, I'm sorry, Rock. That's my bad. Um... It always looked cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I remember playing it back in the day. And yeah, it was fun. Um, I think that... I Because I didn't have a Nintendo 64, so I think that was the first 3D Mario game I ever played. I'll let you off the hook this time if I can come in your box. Uh, what, a, what a way to phrase that. Uh, sure, let me just... Uh, Fiddle with the knobs and such. I ever never owned a Nintendo. Not even like a uh, like a Game Boy. Space Half joined. Welcome. Luffy Gear Five joined. Hmm. Um, my ownership of uh, of Nintendo consoles is actually pretty sporadic. I mean, I can't ha handhelds, but you know what I mean. But, you know. I mean, Switch has got to count, yeah? this into meow. 
suit. And then... Oh, uh, thanks, Patrick. You're very loud in my ears. No problem. Uh, Patrick? What's up? If you can hear me, I'm not getting any audio. Oh, if for you fuck. Can you hear me? Slide, uh, slide the thing down. One. You can hear me. Okay. So you can hear me. We're not getting any audio from you. Hey, can you hear me now? Okay, well, it's my stream now. Hey, can you hear me now? Oh, yeah. But now we can't hear the game. Uh, and I will hopefully be able to rectify that in just one second. Mute that, and then unmute this. Yeah, Ricky Rock Hour. Ricky Rock Hour. Uh, how's that sound? That good for you? Uh, yeah, it's good, but, uh, can I make a request? What's up? Would you mind turning down the music a bit, just so... It, it's not too much trouble. Is that good? Uh, a little bit more. Dude, I can barely hear it, like... Okay, okay, okay that should be fine, this. Okay. Uh, we're gonna start a podcast, but I'll still be text. Oh. Not we get, we gotta get you some more uh, followers so we can get y'all, you in here, Knife. You too, yeah, Luffy. Hey, Knife, um, but Knife, I think you're so about five anyway. No, you don't. You. Nah, really, uh. Do you have a Do you have a Discord uh, knife? So I think I figured out uh, why. Now nah, I'm a BTS guy. Wait, wait. You like Asian music? Yeah, I was about to say, what what does that have to do with Discord? Is there another uh, K-pop band uh, named Discord? Or uh, or does it is it like an abbreviation for busy? For some reason, walking through these spider webs the way it looks, it looks like super creepy to me. Is it not? Well, I mean, are you, are you, are you being funny? No, we have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, it no, says, seriously. I'm a BTS guy. Yeah, are you into K-pop? Yeah, I hate spiders. Yeah, I got arachnophobia as well. Behind the scenes. Oh, okay. Oh. BTS equals behind the scenes. Okay, well we didn't know that, okay? No, I, I mean, I've, I've heard the abbreviation before, but of course, because, you know, it's my mind, I immediately go to uh, BTS. Yeah, fair enough. So, so ha Patrick, you know, it's been so long since we last spoke. How you been? Which is what the K-pop band also stands for. Really? I thought it was something else. Um... You and I talked less than half an hour ago. Oh. Er, I, 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 thought, I thought you were gonna, like, play on it. And be like, oh, yeah, it's been forever, man. How you been? How are the wife? How's the wife? How's the kids? The last time we talked was a thousand years ago. When the know, seas right? boiled and the earth was still it, it, molten It feels rock. like forever since... I know, right? Oh, hey, Mel... You got my name in there. Hmm. I was not aware that uh, the K-pop band's name was uh, behind the scenes. That's yeah, I didn't know that either. Mildly interesting. I was gonna say that's neat, but uh, then I thought, is it? I love how he thought we were joking too. Ah, oh, I should use sizz, not bang. You know there are. Um... You know there's people today that don't know what ATM stands for? I mean, there are people today who still don't know that non-bread is just saying bread bread.
what 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 is where does not come from? Uh, it's, it's uh, Indian. Uh, Japanese. Oh. Uh, or isn't chai tea tea tea? Yes. We're just gonna sit here and do the entire bit from across the Spider Verse. What? Oh, that's like a running joke for um, uh, for Spider Man, uh, for Spider Man India in Across the Spider Verse. Like someone saying chai tea or non bread, and he's just like, chai tea. Chai means tea. You're just saying tea, yeah. tea. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, you're on a you're on a journey of self discovery, and you came to India. Don't eat, play, oh. eat, pray, love me, bro. You um, which is kind of a shame because he actually had a really profound story in the Spider Verse comics. Oh, uh, Indian Spider Man. Yeah. Because when he first comes to the whole society of Spider-Man, he sees that most of them are this fucking white dude. And he's just like, am I just some fucking weird offshoot of Peter Parker? And he has like this whole fucking, uh, like, uh, identity yep, crisis. Uh, 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 Spider-Man. Uh, Spider-Man. Uh, cell phone scan scammer by day, Spider-Man by night. That's awful. Um. Oh come on, that was funny. Is Chai Tea from India? Yeah, isn't it? I'm pretty sure Chai Tea's Patrick, from India. Why won't... You know, you know, I'm starting to get hurt actually. Like that, you don't ever laugh at anything I say, or at least find it mildly amusing. I do. I just also don't want to get in trouble. Oh, okay. Okay. At, at least I'm not. I'm not like talking to a brick wall. <laughs> I was getting worried for a second there. Ah, uh, a brick wall. I mean, I guess there's a reason why you keep me around. Yeah. Um. You know, speaking of Spider-Man and brick walls, what? have you have you ever seen the Spider-Man villain, The Wall? Uh, w w was he created by Donald Trump? He's a guy wearing a brick wall as a costume. Okay. It's the most ridiculous fucking oh. thing. What's, the, uh, what's his power? Nothing! He's just a dude in a brick wall costume! So, like, how does he fight against... Is he like Condiment King? But like for Spider-Man? I mean, he comes from like the 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 either the golden or the silver age, so he was meant to be a legitimate threat. But of course, now it's just fucking ridiculous. The Condiment yeah. King was always supposed to be ridiculous. I once ordered a tea chai, and the barista looked at me like I ate my own face. Oh, Luffy says it is from India. Cool. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, who is Luffy? Did, did I add them? Oh, I haven't added them yet. Uh -huh. Luffy, you want to be friends? You know, you know, I, I'm, I'm really sad that, um... Uh... We're not, we're not gonna be in Naughty Dog's nest the, next to uh, The Last of Us. You know, yeah. like, I... I I thought that random kid. I thought that random kid's uncle definitely worked for Naughty Dog, and was definitely gonna get us a spot. I know, right? Uh, I, I know. mean, like, yeah. look, looking back on it, let's go. The chances were it, he was full of shit. But I mean, uh, also, yeah. I don't want to assume. I don't want to assume you know he was funny? just some dick. You know, it's a funny story, like. All my outlandish stories, right, like, I don't lie about, but that's why I have so few of them. Sorry, I couldn't hurt hear you over Eric throwing two boomerangs. What's up? Oh, well, no, I was just gonna say, I have some outlandish stories, but I, like, they're not, they're all true. Mm. 
Like, did I, ever, did I ever tell you about how I went on a date with Lindsay Lohan's mother? You, you have. Yeah, uh, that's like my one real. That's my one real story. Did I do all right? I feel best oh, I, I also um, I also know someone who has um, uh, the Jeff Goldblum fly. No, Tai Chi, he, like the martial art. Yeah, oh. Yeah. Oh. You, you know the prop. So you said it the uh, other way around, and they okay. I see. You know the the prop from uh, Jeff Goldblum's The Fly. Uh, yeah, the one that that uh, Wolf has. Oh well, I was gonna say yeah. I know someone who has that. But you had to go and ruin. It. My apologies. How dare I? Yeah. Um. You know, I told him to put up a little sign when he puts that in the museum, and uh, and just have it say Jeff Goldblum on on tour. Um, I don't know if I ever told the story. If I've told the story yet, uh, I have a funny story from when I went to um to Awesome Con. Or wait, was it Awesome? No, it was Galaxy Con. Uh, uh, last month. Um, okay. So my friend is a big fan of wrestling. And, uh, one of his favorite wrestlers was there. Uh, spe uh specifically a wrestler by the name of Orange Cassidy. Um, and the whole time we're there, uh, you know, I, I'm basically just trying to get him to, you know, go over there and uh, get a an autograph from him, but like the whole time he, he's just like too shy to uh, to do it. And like the first day we're there, I eventually get tired of his shit and just head over to Orange Cassidy to get some uh, to get an autograph. Uh, the problem was I was a bit strapped for cash, and when he said it was like sixty bucks, I was like. Mm. Like, I'd love to get my friend that, but uh, again, I was strapped for cash, so I, I couldn't do it at the time. Um, then I called him. Couldn't you have just paid half and asked him for money? Um, well, mainly, uh, the reason I, I really wanted to get him the uh, autograph was so that Orange Cassie would write, uh, Dear Dimitri, stop being a giant pussy. That would have been hilarious. Yeah. Um. So you know. I love how we were literally talking about Dimitri earlier too. Eh. I mean, that's probably part of, part of the reason I'm remembering this. Um. So anyway, uh, we go the next day, and I've 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 called in a a debt, or at least uh, part of a debt, uh, that someone owes me, uh, and I had. You know, a hundred extra dollars. Um, so I go over there again, and I'm like, "All right, I got the money. I would like one autograph that says to Dimitri, stop being such a gigantic pussy." And it, and he's like, "Okay, I'm done." Um, and uh, I take out my card, and he's just like, "Oh, sorry, we were only accepting cash." And it's just like, "Fuck." And I, I totally would have gone to the cash machines, or the ATMs that they uh, had there. But you want to know what? When we were walking to the convention hall, we passed by this guy that is just furiously cussing. Because as it turns out, all the ATMs were down at the event. Like, <laughs> like what a fucking kick in the teeth. Dude, you know, if he, if he really wanted to be cool, he could have just given it to you for free. I mean, here's the thing. Literally, his character is not giving a fuck. Like, he actually had an assistant there uh, to do all the talking for him. 
No. Yeah. So he's 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 Jewish. I mean, that's that's the character. Yeah. I I can only assume Orange Cassidy in real life is is a cool guy. You know, you know, for some reason, as soon as you said Orange Cassidy, I was I was, thought they were a woman. I can see that. Um, like, does, does does the name Orange not sound like a woman's name? Mm. Um. You know the the best part is that w one of his like bigger intros is him coming out and they just start dumping uh, orange juice from the ceiling. On him? Uh, on him, on the stage, yeah. And does he react to it, or...? No. I, that would suck, like, that, that, that shit's sticky and, like, ugh. I mean, I assume what it actually is, is just water that they've colored orange. Yeah, I know, but the idea of it creeps me out. I hate being covered in sticky shit. Not that I've been covered in shit before, but, you know, sticky stuff. Rock, is there something you want to tell the rest of the class? You, you, you don't know what I'm into, okay? Maybe when I win a bet, I brush my sister's teeth. I don't know. Did you say you brush your sister's teeth? Have you not seen that anime? No. Uh, yeah, there's an anime where a brother, you know, like, what he wants to do is brush his sister's teeth. Yeah, because that's not sketch at all. So, yeah. so he lies her down on the bed and he, and he uh, vigorously uh, brushes her teeth. Now, I know you said this was an anime. Yeah. Are you sure you don't mean hentai? Uh, did I stutter? I'm just saying, we should get the nomenclature correct. Uh, well, uh oh god, I've missed a few comments by them. By, uh, by Luffy and Knife. No, 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 I, I, I read them. Uh, yeah, sticky feeling is the worst. The hell, why do you brush your sister's teeth? I have to use super soft bristles. <laughs> I... Ye... Do you see what you've started? What? I am placing this thoroughly on your shoulders. Explain to me what you're placing on my shoulders. This. I don't this know talk you, of you of teeth, teeth brushing now. What? I, I mean, how do you brush your teeth? I brush my own teeth. That's how. No, I mean, like, yeah, but like, like, do you do it before you eat, after? What kind of toothpaste do you use? Do you use electric toothbrush? Who like? the fuck? Okay, you you need to answer this to me. What kind of sociopath is brushing their teeth? Before they eat. Um. My gums are sensitive. People who aren't fresh. I used to do it all the time before I drank orange juice. Here's a public service announcement to everyone, anyone watching this. If anyone you have you are ever involved with brushes their teeth before <laughs> they eat, run. RUN FROM THEM! <laughs> they are not to be trusted! Uh, I'm not saying I do it currently, I, I just don't run from people to get off the Silvano takes the stage! They have done something in their past. Does it make you feel better if I don't brush my teeth? Makes me feel better if you brush your teeth like a, <laughs> like you're not a psycho. Honestly, in all reality, I probably brush my teeth once a day, instead of two times. Mm. Do you floss at least? 
Uh, I don't know why I'm talking. I don't have the best dental health care. Or dental care. Actually, actually, my teeth are actually really good. Uh, I went to the dentist uh, a little before I met you, so... How long ago was that? Three months? Uh... The dance floss. <laughs> the dance floss. I, yeah, I do floss from time to time. It's not like an everyday thing. The only dance I dance is the dance of my people. I know, right? Wait, wait, wait. So do you, do you use an electric? You never answered the question. Uh, electric. Okay, okay, okay. What, uh, what, what brand is this electric toothbrush? Uh, I don't fucking know. I don't... Alright, all right, all right, go grab it, we'll wait. I'm not gonna go and grab my two. Uh, Why did you start this? Why did you start this? Patrick, go grab it, we'll wait. I'm not... <laughs> Your ridiculous fucking... Toothbrush talk. Patrick... Patrick, what brand... <laughs> Did he actually go to grab it? No, I'm not! Come on, Patrick! Oh, for the love of... Patrick, I don't want to get up. How far is the bathroom from your room? I mean, it's... You know, I mean, it's right across the hallway, but that's not the point! What do you mean it's not the point? Just, like, literally, you don't even have to bring it back with you. Just check the brand and check back. I'm gonna kill this troll. How about, how... Are you talking about me or the troll? I'm talking about the troll on screen. Yeah, again, we're not sure which... Oh, for fuck's sake. Fine. You fucking weirdos. Thank you, Nike. I Actually, you know, Patrick, after you're also gonna have to post a video with you holding it and reviewing the brand. Actually, uh, you know, Patrick, I should redeem my coins. Give you some coins for this. Uh, exchange for coins. Here you go, Patrick. <sighs> Fucking weird bullshit. Oh, it's oh, brawn. It's, it's the alien. What is it? It's brawn. B R A U N. Okay, okay, brawn. Uh, okay, so like, what color is it? Like, describe it to us. It's teal. So it's like it's so it's like a blue. Okay. Hey, hey, can, can you turn it on and put it right up to the, the mic real quick? I refuse to take part in this anymore. Why? Patrick, Patrick, I just sent you a tiny dice. Come on. Why? <laughs> Do you want more views or not? <sighs> this is the perfect way to get more views. Oh, oh hey, what's up, Len? Fuck. You guys hear it? I can't hear anything. Good. Is it on? So I legitimately can't actually bring it over here right now. Or at least I, I could bring uh, it over here, but I couldn't, like, turn it on. It's... I forgot to plug it in earlier. 
Oh my god. Okay, fine. I get mine wet and then toothpaste. Yeah, Patrick, what, what, uh... Well, of course you get it wet first. You gotta clean off any... I mean, it's been in the bathroom all day. You gotta get out okay, 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 get okay, off okay, any okay, particles okay. that are on there. Um, well, that's actually rough when you think about it. I actually don't keep my, uh, toothbrush in the bathroom. Which is kind of gross when you think about the fact that I keep my hairbrush in the bathroom. When you fail to plan, you plan to fail. Hey Patrick, do you have a Walgreens by you by chance? Okay. You need to tell me what you're going, planning on doing with this information. Because it's just weird you're asking. Hi Milo! <laughs> Hello Milo. Thank you for coming to keep my sanity. <laughs> <laughs> My wife just goes it dry. Hmm. Uh, yeah, Pat. Uh, I didn't know you were married. Um, wait, 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 Patrick. So do you have a walking idea? Yes, there's a Walgreens near me. Okay, what? Why? Why is it? Because <laughs> this is a weird line of questions. <laughs> Finishing up my coffee. Uh, the name of the stream should just be making Patrick feel uncomfortable. I feel like this is going to end up with me getting taken. <laughs> like what weird, like what weird fucking, like what, what weird, the blind frazzle says lol. Like what weird fucking Saw spinoff plot am I currently in? Why would I need to know if there's a Walgreens by you if I was if I was making a saw trap? Wouldn't I, wouldn't I ask if there was a Home Depot by you? I don't know. The real Jigsaw c could MacGyver that shit. And I mean, I already know there's an Amazon Fresh by you, and I know that you live in Virginia, so it, it can't be that hard to find you. Okay, don't just f***ing say that, okay? Oh, sorry. Like, one of these days, I'm gonna say something out of pocket, and motherfuckers are gonna come find me, and they're gonna come to this fucking stream, and I'm gonna be pissed at you. <laughs> this is good. This is how I'm going to end up beating on my lawn. How you gonna end up what? This is how I'm gonna get end up beaten on my lawn. Beaten on your lawn for what? I don't know. Probably some asshole who thinks that Power Ranger Super Mega Force was actually a good season. All right. Well, well you know what he thinks about that, boys. Don't worry. I'm here to help. Thank you. Go beer, go joined. Welcome. All right. You know it's really funny. Go beard go is just like probably like like dying in the bed. like just like listening to all this. Like I don't even know if you've heard of the thing about the Walgreens, but oh my god. Oh god. I'm gonna what? find out where he is and order a pizza to his house while he streams so we can hear it. Wait, wait. wait That'd wait, actually be kind of cool. No, 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 you, you know what you do? Order him a family-sized, uh, salad. A family-sized what? Salad. I mean, hey, if it's like a salad from, uh, from, uh, uh, Olive Garden, like absolutely. 
No, 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 it's gonna be one from Domino's. Ugh! Why yep. would you put that evil on me? Yep. Don't you put that evil on me, Ricky Bobby! With, 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 with blue cheese and everything. Oh! Oh! Fuck blue cheese, man! You don't like blue cheese? No, I don't! I don't... You know what else I don't and, like and doing? I don't like... On stream. I also don't like licking mold! Well, I mean, nobody's asking you to lick mold, I mean, you know... Blue That's cheese, basically what you're doing with... Blue... Literally, the blue the, stuff the in it. The Domino's blue cheese hits different, okay? I got a salad from Olive Garden today, and it was huge. $22. And two soups. Oh. Oh, I'd love some soup at Toscana. Mmm, so good. Dude, all cheese is mold. So, uh... You're right. However, blue cheese is still gross. Wait, wait, I'm right about what? Uh, uh, Knife just said that dude all cheese is mold. I got the yeah. soup in my... Well, I, I don't think American cheese is and mold, And Mrs. Got but... Chicken and, and Yoki. It's, it's I've never been a big fan mold. of Gnocchi, but, uh, you know, to each their own. I love that I said that, and just a few seconds ago I was like, TO HELL WITH BLUE CHEESE! Yeah, I know, right? Wait, wait, so do you, do you like, uh, do you like cottage cheese? No, not really. Yeah, I don't, I don't like cottage cheese either. Like, I don't feel as strongly ricotta? about that, but yeah, I'm not a big fan of cottage what cheese. What about ricotta? Do you like ricotta? I don't. Uh, it's... Yeah, I really like ricotta. Like, 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 wait, 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 wait. So you're telling me you never have, like, a calzone? I've had calzone. I, I just don't think I've had a calzone with, uh, ricotta cheese. Dude, I love cottage. I mean, that's that's I mean, definitely their own. yeah. That's definitely one of those ones where I'm like, yeah, sure, to each their own. I don't have strong feelings about yeah, I, uh, cottage cheese. But like, um, you know, like I did. I think ricotta is ten times better than cottage cheese. Uh, you know what? Me and my family had the other night ricotta that was fantastic. Blows, okay. you're, you're you're lucky. You're mod, and I can't I can't use you. Oh god, cheese war! The cheese war! It's, it's flavorless. It's not flavorless. You add some salt to it, it's very good. Wait, 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 wait. See, wait, wait, wait. Uh, nice. So you're telling me you never eat, like, um, like, like a calzone or, like, I don't know, uh, some manicotti or some ravioli? Like, that, that's all stuff with ricotta, and that's really good. So you're um, telling me you hate it, like, all together? I, I find it... If I have to add salt, then it's bad. I mean, I think cottage cheese, like... I don't know, it's just... It's, 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 no. Calzones are for children. Oh. How dare you, sir. How dare you. Look, a calzone is a pizza you can take on the go. Yeah, that's pretty much. It's a pizza burrito. That's what it is. E exactly. That's exactly calzones what it is. Are delicious, dude. Just eat a normal pizza. You can't eat a normal pizza while driving a car. I mean, you can, but it's kind of it's a pain in the ass. Yeah, but what if it's real greasy? It's gonna drip all over your like dashboard and everything, or or on your lap. That sounds like a challenge, motherfucker! The hell I can't. You questioning me? Wait, wait, maybe like a margarita piece of pizza you could eat on the go. What is That's your... not super greasy. What's your opinion on thin crust? On thin crust? Like if we're, uh, like I, if we're doing a I, whole fucking thing. Might as well go the whole hog. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Um, honestly, I prefer a thicker crust, but uh, you know, I I, I could live with thin crust. Um, honestly, like um, you know, I really love stuffed crust, but like it, you know, I I don't get uh, I want a pizza now. 
Why? Because we're talking about pizza, that's why. In fairness, I always want a pizza. Oh, wait, wait, Patrick, I just thought it would be too pizza for your, uh, for your channel. What? Walgreens Pizza. You go into Walgreens, you buy ingredients, and, 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 and you make pizza from the ingredients you buy at Walgreens. Or, to get the same effect, I could just... <laughs> or, to get the same effect, I could just poison myself. Um... Think... Think... Think crust is for Californians and pores? How dare you! <laughs> Californians and pores? The slander. The oh, sheer God. audacity. That frozen like pizza that you can buy in a supermarket. Look, unless you've got a pizza stone, it never comes out right. In, in the, unless you got a what? A pizza stone. Like, like, like the the pizzazz thing. Um. No, it's 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 like literally a rock that you can put in your oven to uh to cook the pizza on top of. Really? I mean my pizza come out good. Like I, I I feel like frozen pizza the the dough is never right. It's either uh, it's either burnt to a cr without a pizza stone, it's either burnt to a crisp, or I might as well be eating a fing handful of dough. Wow, Patrick. No, it's like a a huge play play. Yeah, basically, okay. yeah. Don't you have to oil it up first, though? I mean, that's true of anything that you're gonna bake uh, something, you know, with dough on. Okay, okay, okay. So you guys have any ideas for? Are you, are you just grinding for the stream? Is that? Uh, no. I'm actually I am actually trying to get to a boss. Oh, okay. I was wondering. It's just a fucking labyrinth. So, so do you have dungeon. a favorite pizza from a supermarket or no? I Nobody say, better fucking say Tombstone or something like that. There is one brand of pizza that uh one brand of store brand uh, one brand of store pizza that uh is actually pretty good. Screaming, oh, screaming Sicilian. Bagel sauce, cheese, pepperoni, uh, toaster oven. Oh, uh, oh, that's okay. That, that's how you make the pizza from Walgreens. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen that, but I'll have to give it a try. You should DM me that after. It actually sounds pretty good. Uh, like, definitely go for their, uh, mozzarella, cause, like, it, it, oh, man, they're, they're, like, extra wait, wait, cheese wait. pizza. Hey, hey, Patrick. What's up? Do you have a Walmart by you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, you should totally try, um, the Sam's Choice, uh, Buffalo Chicken pizza. It's actually really good. I mean, uh, I mean, um... Walmart is actually uh, where I got uh, Screaming Sicilian from as well. Oh, okay. okay. Um, not only is it really good pizza, uh, each box has Wild a little car. Said. Each box has a little cardboard mustache. Oh, okay, okay. I, I know what you're talking about now. I've seen that. Yeah. I always thought it looked. I always thought it looked really weird, so I didn't want to buy it. Uh, like the their their uh, mozzarella cheese pizza is so good because yeah, like yeah. it 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 also has like fucking straight up balls of mozzarella on it as well. Uh, uh, fucking great! If... Oh, oh, by the by 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 the way, Patrick. What's up? Um, you know what mothballs are, right? Yeah. You ever smell them? Yeah. 
arms. How do you get their legs apart? Just reminds me of the day I met the Sugandis. What? When I met... When I met oh, a... Tr no, suck on me, not... Damn it! That was a, that was a quick comeback. Mm. I, I almost fell for it. <laughs> he got you so good. The who? The Sugandis nets. Yeah, yeah. He got you so good, yeah. I like the deep breath passion. Just, it's just a, it's just a, it's just a sigh of disappointment in myself. <laughs> it's like, god damn it. Oh, uh... I mean, I guess you've never been to Nathan's, huh? Uh... You know, the, like, uh... Well, Coney Island's not too far away from me. Mm. So, uh, you, you know, uh, you know what I'm talking about? Nathan's? It's a hot dog stand? Uh, I, I've never heard of Nathan's, but, uh... Wait, 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 but they sell their brands of hot dogs in every supermarket. Do they? Yeah. I don't think Nathan's I've... Hot dogs? I don't think I've gotten hot dogs since, uh... Probably since my dad passed. Oh. Shit. Things got dark real quick. Oh, I mean, it's it's just that, you know, he really liked hot dogs. So, you know, like, every time we went to the grocery store, we, he would, you know, get a thing of hot dogs. I wasn't trying to... I wasn't you know, trying to... No, 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 but, like, uh, Patrick, you know something I, I do with people whenever I meet them? Uh, like, and, and they tell me that their dad's dead. <laughs> Uh, I, I say mine too. High five. <laughs> Dead Dad's Club, yeah. <laughs> Gaming and food with a legendary know, right? stream. It, it, it's really funny because we all do it in Aaron's live stream because none of us have like a living father except for like Beard. <laughs> but you know, Beard's father is like from Spain and he doesn't talk to him. We just all make fun of Beard for, for being the only one with a father. Ha! <laughs> Your dad hasn't passed. Ha <laughs> ha. That's horrible. Uh, I think I think I'm starting to rub off on you, Patrick, and not in a good way. Oh god. I if Beard is still here, I'm kidding, man. I'm kidding. Obviously. Yeah, I No, no. I, I hope he watches this video. But he literally just came in and commented one thing and then he left. I think he left because he saw me in here and he was like, oh, great fucking rock show. Just, oh, god damn it. <sighs> no, because Beard gets really annoyed. Um, because, like, whenever I go into, like, anyone else's and I start talking about, like, random shit, like I like to do, he, uh, he's just like, great, you make it the fucking rock show. Uh... Like, okay, okay, I cannot... <clears throat> me, uh, me and Lotus were actually talking about this earlier today. I cannot stand people who, like, ask, like, boring questions, like, oh, hey, what's your, uh, you know, just general fucking, like, oh, hey, where's your, where are you from? What's your favorite movie? Like, I get some of that, but, like, or, like, oh, hey, do you watch football? Like, stuff like that. No, I, I go, like, oh, hey, what's the sign of the refrigerator? Um, let me ask you, do you got, do you guys got a mod pizza down there? Or up there? What? On Terrible Geography? Yo, I just finished uh, the game of Valorant. Pizza. Good going, Luffy. Uh, I can't say that we do, but uh, you ever see uh, Spider-Man 2? Toby McGuire? Yeah. Uh, we have Joe's Pizza. Really? 
Uh, I, I mean, uh, yeah. Is that the uh, pizza place from Pizza Time? Yeah, yeah, that one. I got blueberry cobbler coffee cream. Oh, that sounds good. You know, honestly, like, I never actually thought it was good pizza when I ate there. Uh, because, like, okay, okay, I like New York style pizza, don't get me wrong. But you know that crumbly shit on the bottom? Do you know what I'm talking about? Have you ever had New York pizza? Um. Yeah. Okay, like that crumbly ball stuff that's on the bottom, I hate that. I'm just like, I want it to just be flat. Or whatever. Like, I, I don't like the, like all these little crumb bit pieces coming flying off my pizza. I mean, I've, I've had... You know, they, they claim it's New York style pizza, but I mean, like, I've never experienced... Like, the weird crumbs that you're talking about. You, so you're telling me you pick up the pizza and it's just, you know, like, everything stays together, there's nothing that falls off the bottom? Yeah. Chicago deep. Okay. Yeah, it is not, good, I just don't drink not, coffee. Not only is Chicago-style pizza not better than New York pizza, it's not pizza. Chicago-style pizza is a fucking casserole. I'm surprised you haven't decided to finish up your pizza by okay, adding Patrick. some... What? Oh, I... No, you should finish what you were saying. Uh, I'm just I'm just doing the, uh, the pizza monologue by, um, Jon Stewart. Here uh, goes nothing. I was gonna let you finish, but okay. It's just... I didn't mean to pick off, I was just like, eh. But here's the thing, I never, I, I never intend to interrupt people, I just have, like, ideas that I need to get out. If I don't get them out, like, as soon as I think of them, I forget them. Mm -hmm. That's why when it, someone tells me to hold my thought, like, it'll take me, like, five minutes to think, what the fuck was I thinking about? Okay, hold on one sec. Uh, <laughs> immediately, I'm just like, hey, hold on a sec. Uh, okay, Lou, I'll see you, all right, all right, I'll see you next night. time, man. Yeah, have a good night. Luke, Luke, take care. Go Cubs! Keep coming in here, and uh, maybe, uh, maybe Freak will make him up. How many mods am I allowed to have? Uh, 30. Jesus. What the fuck would I do with 30 mods? I, I don't know, uh, me and Beard, we once made a joke once, uh, if Aaron made everyone who comes in to slide stream a mod, if we we can literally just have the mod wars and we're all just talking over each other and muting each other. You know what? Banned. You can't ban me yeah, on the I mod. Know. Oh yeah, banned again. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah, just leave. Yeah, like Patrick, like can we get like a like a thing where where you're just going around trying food? Um, I don't know if I, I, know. I if I like... if I get to a point where um, uh, but then who's gonna vote in the poll? Ah, he's yeah, got no, a point. Right? We already have we already have a problem getting people to vote in the polls. Yeah, I know. All right, all right, all right, all right. Tell you what, tell you what. We'll unmod, uh, we'll unmod him, we'll unmod knife, and then, and then he can vote in the polls. <laughs> Just unmod people to vote in the poll. Yeah, yeah. Th and then we'll mod him back right after. <laughs> You're fucking Cause, ridiculous. Cause that's not fucking. Okay, duck. Cause that's not fucking with the algorithm. Yeah, yeah. That certainly won't tip somebody off that something's going on. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> mod, mod again. Ma matter of fact, didn't, didn't you, like, freak out one time because, like, I unfollowed you, like, a bunch of times? Oh, cutscene. Oh, yeah, you, he, to, uh, get the, uh, to listen to the, uh, hey, to the follow sounds. Oh, yeah, it turns out that, uh, the potion that Vince was taking for battles 
he's getting from this fucking thing by feeding it other fighters from the tournament. Oh. Yep. What a dick. Uh, but... Just perfect. A warrior made you're not a cat, you're a spider. It's not perfect. I smell it on her skin. We must drain her of her essence while she is still fresh. You know, in this one, um... When uh, the guys in Dragon Ball Z fought straight-up monsters. You know, something I've always wondered about. I won't be needing Whatever to happened. me any further, thanks. So this is who's behind it all. Whatever happened to what? Sir Hendrick must have missed I was gonna let the cutscene finish. Oh, okay. Those years ago. Huh? Huh? Nicely done, lassie. Every time Rab talks, all I can hear is the fucking Scotsman from Samurai Jack. The liquid I found, and that's what you drink before your fights, isn't it? What your friend here squeezes from the fighters he kidnapped. That... that was you? <laughs> Perhaps not all humans are as stupid as our muscle-bound friend here. That's right, old man. Hendrix scarred me, but he did not kill me. The extract. It was the only way to regain my strength. So I had Vince bring me the choicest morsels. And why would he help me do such a thing, you ask? Because I offered to share the fruits of my labor to give him strength beyond imagining. Who could refuse such a Juicy offer. <laughs> Someone with half a brain? I couldn't keep on winning forever. And if I wasn't winning, I wasn't bringing in the money we needed for the orphanage. Sorry, partner, but I can't let those kids down. Which means I can't let you and your friends leave. <sighs> Bitch, there's seven so it's of okay us. okay to kill people as well. So it's okay to take people out as long as it's for... Not now. To save children. Children. You get to save children. Oh, will you look at yourself, laddie. Do you not see what that stuff's I mean, look, man, you? it's 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 an orphanage, but then again... For human consumption. Like, this is... From the this is just out. fucked, man. It's a this is literal human life. sacrifice. Okay, but can I, can I also say, like... Man. You know, like the... uh, I guess cheaters never prosper, huh? <laughs> the, you know, the, the the children he's helping, like the children in the orphanage. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're not going to grow up to be doctors or lawyers. Like, let's be honest. I don't know. This is, you know, this is a fantasy world. One of them could be the chosen one. Who the fuck knows? No, no, they're probably going to end up in far It's fucked up. Like, I mean, am I wrong? Then? Okay, nap time. Keep night, night. Busy. Brush your teeth, y'all. I'll see if I can get those. Night, wolf. Down. Or night, knife. Okay. Sorry. All right. Good night, wolf. Oh, you never mind. So does uh does does moving around make a difference? Um when you're fighting. I don't think so. I think there's like certain care certain uh, fights that actually it does affect shit. So then why not just stand in front of them the whole time? 
Eh, it's just fun. Can he just stab you with his legs? I mean, you'd think so. Yeah. Uh, this guy, like, seriously reminds me of this one, uh, uh, this one Digimon from back in the day. I forget what it's called. It's like Kunemon or something. It's basically a big spider with, uh, like, braids on either side of its head, and, it, like, it's got hands that are, like, pulling on the braids for some reason. Oh! Oh, that reminds me. Um, do you like, um, Apple Jacks? You ever have that cereal? They're okay. Um, they got they got rid of uh, Cinnamon. <sighs> right. I think I was actually the one that told you about that. Uh, no, I I, I noticed it. I, I think I was talking. About it. Yeah, and, and Apple. You know, they, they don't look the same anymore. They're just like. They're just sort of. They're just like, sort of like generic, cartoony, meh. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, Cinnamon's no longer Jamaican. He doesn't have the dreadlocks anymore. Yeah. Which is super dumb. I get the feeling someone complained and... Yeah. I mean... And our healer's like, confused. Shit. I mean, but those... Com uh, those commercials have been around forever. You know what I mean? Yeah. Wait, wait, so you really never had an N64? Yeah, no, actually... I say that, but I actually do have an N64 now. Uh, it used to uh, it used to be belong to my uh, sister's ex boyfriend. Uh, oh right, you told me. Like yeah, I just don't have you know any games or controllers or any of the wires, so it's basically oh, just right, a right. paperweight. Right. Actually, no, I take that back. I do have hey, one. Of the, I do have a controller for it. Patrick, can I ask you a strange question? Sure, what's up? Okay, okay. So, like... Her and her boyfriend, did they get along? Like, yeah. Like, they were good together? Now, like, did... Like, were there any awkward moments, like... You, between you guys? I'm not sure what you mean. I think you already know what I'm asking. I think I do know. I'm not going to comment. Okay, so I'll take that as yes. Ah, uh, shit. Uh, okay. I don't know. I I I just want to hear like some funny stories or some awkward stories. This guy really, really fucked me. Um, I, I didn't really want to hear an awkward story like that. That's not what I meant and you know it. Oh. Uh, oh. oh, you're talking about the spider ball. Yeah. Oh. Okay, I thought you were like, one time this guy really... Oh, man. Uh, he fucking stunned, he fucking confused, uh, Serena, and she has, like, a bunch of the really good, um, healing spells. Wait, how old is Serena supposed to be anyway? I don't know, do any of these have, do any of these characters have fucking ages? I don't know. Okay, good. Dragon Quest Eleven Serena. Let's see. Uh please go to sleep. Watch your begin. Shit. Uh 
Watch her be in her like her thirties or something. Or forties. Yeah. Please just go to sleep. Damn it. Oh, thank God in heaven. What, how old is she? Uh, oh, that's not who... Oh. When did he get revived? You absolute bitch of a spider cock-sucking bitch. Yeah. Fucking binds Serena good. and kills off Veronica. Shit. But... Patrick, I don't think I don't think he's a cocksucker. You want to know how I know that? How? Uh, because I don't think anyone would be dumb enough to let their Johnson be in this town. Yes, yes. You know, sometimes I wonder, like. Random people who join are just like, what the fuck are they talking about? I mean, I have to imagine that they do. Okay, Veronica's back up. And he's pepped. Great. You know, I, I, I just picked her beard on the outside. Like, just watching stream and just fucking cringing. Or like laughing. Just like, oh, rock you and fucking rock shit. And I don't have enough MP to... Okay, spell zing, Eric. Get your dead ass back up. Spell rabble rouser. Uh, no, it doesn't look like their age is ever mentioned. Okay. Well, it's not, it's not that big a deal. And Eric's dead again. Wait, wait, wait. The, uh, Big Patrick. What's up? You ever, uh, you ever watch the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mick? Oh, yeah, it was fucking great. Oh, God, okay. So, what I want to ask you about that, right? Is, you, you know how, uh, Billy had a spider son? Yeah. What, what would you do if, like, a spider, like, had, like, a giant spider? Like the size of the, the one in the show, at the time of the day, the person saying, Hey, Dad, what's up? I mean. Like, I know how you're dreadfully scared of spiders. I mean. Oh, jeez, this is not good. Um. I mean, if it's sentient enough to, uh, if it's sentient enough that, you know, it considers me its parent and can actually articulate that to me, sure, fuck it, why not? I'd accept it, I guess. Okay. okay. I, I it, like, but like the way it walks around is super creepy, and like, uh, like it, let's say you cut your hand open one day, and then it just looks at you and just starts drooling. Yeah, I'd probably kill it, but then again, I'd do the same thing to a fucking human child. <laughs> If it started drooling at the sight of my cut hand. Oh. Yeah, I... Look. There's a lot of bridges I'm, I'm willing to cross. Cannibalism, not one of them. 
What? The, um, oh, there's a lot of uh, things I'm willing to overlook. Cannibalism is not one of them. Yeah, I was at cannibalism. I mean, it's it's fucking drooling at the sight of my. Uh... Yeah, but it's also a spider. Cannibalism is when a like a human eats another human or the same species. Same species. Okay, I guess I guess what I meant to say was that when someone looks looks uh, appears to be trying to take a uh, bite out of me, that's when you know I have to draw a line. You're tell you're telling me a uh, tuxedo mask is ever big. Thank God I still have Sylvanda. Patrick. What's up? Has a tuxedo mask ever beat you? Has a tuxedo mask ever what? Uh, yeah. Bit you. And you, know, you don't judge him on that. That's because he's a fucking dog. Well, I mean, in this scenario, it's a giant spider. Also, he's not really... Also, it's not really biting that he's doing. You know what I mean? Oh, it's affecting it dips. Yeah. And Silv and Silvando is already down. Fuck me. Would this fucking thing just die already. This might be the longest boss fight in the game. I mean, the real problem is that I haven't been fucking. Uh, uh, grinding like I should. supposed to be the end in that scene I mean I was supposed to win is what the answer is yeah yeah but like let's say you lost like then he would have you after I, like, he, I guess he would have fucking eaten me oh okay he probably would have done to me the same thing that he did to all the other uh, people that Vince has brought him You know, I got I got some fucking uh, side quests I never finished. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, did you just whistle at him? Uh, no, I shot him in the back with a crossbow. Oh, let's see. And now that I've paused, he's basically just stuck there, running towards us. Uh, Later, asshole. Good. He's like, I'm gonna get ya! I'm gonna get ya! I can teleport too! Oh. No, you can't. You know what would be really weird? If what? the monsters actually, like, spoke to you, like... Okay, you know how, like, in Pokemon, like, the gym battle... Uh, like, people battle you for gyms? Uh-huh. No, no. 
not not for gyms, but like you know, like when you're just walking around and there's people randomly standing in front of areas, and then you got to battle them to proceed. Yeah. And then they just say random shit to you. Yeah. Imagine if the monsters did that before you battled them. Like they they, they said, uh, they, they said something like, I'm, "I'm circumcised, but my grandpa isn't. He's the odd one out." And then they just start, "Let's battle." <laughs> That's just very... <laughs> or, 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 or just like, you know, like... Um, like, like when, you, when, you, when you go to fight a goblin, just be like... Ah, my, my parents are going, currently going through a divorce. Let's get into a fight. <laughs> And it just continues on like nothing ever happened. I... <laughs> I don't even know how to respond to that. But then like when you go to fight like another goblin, it's just gonna be like... Uh, have, have, have you seen my son around? Uh, me and his mom are, are going through a rough divorce. I'm going through a real rough patch. Yeah. In fact, the only thing that could make it worse if, is if, I don't know, if my son died. Yeah. Just something like that. Dark, dark jokes. Uh, you, you know, you challenge another one and like, you know... I, I really like playing Metal Gear Solid too. My favorite part is the push-up part. <laughs> then they got what they deserve. <laughs> Wait, push up part. You mean pull up, right? Please, yeah. for the love of God, don't tell me there's a push up thing as well. No, no, pull up. That's... Oh, thank God. No, no, no. Push ups, that's how you increase your leg strength. Didn't you know that? Oh, God, no. Leg strength? That, is, that doesn't make any sense for push ups. I don't know. I just had to come up with something out of my ass. Yeah. Uh. God, that would be such a... That would be such a fucking, uh, Kojima move. To make a fucking thing where... You can do all these different exercises with Snake. And you really yeah. should, because it's the only way to increase, uh... Stats that you need later. Oh, yeah, that'd be hilarious. Oh, oh, um... Or, or wait, 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 wait. Like, like, one of the battle, battle encounters, like, for this game would be like... You know, um... You know, um, have, have you read Ted Krasinski's new book? I really enjoy it. Uh, there's a blacksmith by the furnace in Hotto who seems to be oh, short of supplies. Ted Kaczynski, uh, isn't that who they think the Zodiac Killer was? No. Who the fuck is Ted Kaczynski? Look him up. Oh god, what fucking... I'm gonna get up on- I'm gonna end up on a fucking watch list because of you one day. Well, oh, you're fucking looking up Eric Harris the other day. Ted Kaczynski. Yeah, cause you fucking said- uh, Also known as the Unabomber. I was close. Yeah, he actually wrote a book. Again, I was close. You know, guy famously kills a bunch of people in the 80s. Yeah. Have, um... Of course, then again, the same can be said about Ronald Reagan. Um... Oh my gosh. Fuck Reagan. I, did, I, didn't, I didn't know you felt that strong of a Patrick 
Oh, I absolutely do. So many of the problems in America right now can be fucking or, traced or, back or, directly or, or, to that or asshole. Or another better bad encounter would be like, I, I, I just got done reading uh, the Communist Man of Manifesto. What battle? <laughs> Communist Jerry wants to. <laughs> <laughs> Like, 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 I, I enjoy brushing my sister's teeth. Let's battle. I'm so sorry for your loss. Mortar Jeremy wants to battle. I was actually in the, I, I was actually in the cafeteria when Eric Harris stormed the building. Let's battle. God, I can't believe how lucky I was. <laughs> Survivor of. All these things are slain by me. Like, I have fucking, like, a uh, dragon quest here. No, oh god, I was actually gonna. It was, what I was about to say was actually darker than that. What, 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 what was it? Survivor of 9 11, uh, Oscar wants to battle. Wait, wait, so they have usernames, too? Like, oh, no, that's really only in, um, in, um, uh, 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 Pokemon. Oh, uh, okay. No, I, I was thinking, like, in, in Dragon Quest 2, though. Uh. Oh, my gosh. I might have to cut that out. That might not be cool. <laughs> Uh. The plane just hit the second tower. Let's back. Jeez. I think you and I are the only ones that are still uh, in the chat. Yeah, I know. But like for fucking YouTube, that oh. would be super funny. Oh god. Uh. Uh, let's see here, uh... Patrick, oh, I, I feel like once you get big enough, like, your older videos are just gonna be Oh, absolutely. Someone's gonna be going through a bunch of my old shit and just be like... Like, like, oh, what no. Fuck? Like, like, Eric Harris is not something to be laughing about, okay? I would just like to say that I completely blame all of this on, on Rock. Fair enough, I mean, everybody does. Can you jump in the pool? Can you swim? Uh, I can, but I can't jump in there. Oh my I God. think I can jump in a pool over here. Wait, wait, wait. Does that guy have a huge mouth? Uh, his drum does. Oh, I was, like, so confused. It looked like... Yeah, they have, uh, they have a living drum. Oh, oh, you know what game I want to see you play for some reason? What? Uh, Yokai Watch. You know, so many people shit talk that game and just be like, oh, it's just a knockoff of Pokemon. It's just like. It is, but it's a good knockoff. I mean, yeah, like, especially since it's doing something interesting and different with the battle system. I've actually never played it, I just. I've heard good things. Um, it's sort of. It sort of does auto battling, and like the 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 trick to the battling is that uh, all your yokai are on a little dial on the uh, bottom screen, and you um, you know they'll do their attacks or you know whatever their special move is, um, but you know you've got to um, have them on the field to do their thing. Oh, I got you. Like, it's actually an interesting idea. Oh, you know what anime that you really need to bring back? What? Uh, you ever see the uh, anime Dead Man Wonderland? I have. I think the reason that they stopped doing that, though, was because, um... Didn't the manga stop? Oh, is that what happened? I think so. I think they basically ran out of material to adapt. 
Why'd the manga stuff? I think it was a case of another project that the mangaka was working on got big. Um... Like, let me... let's see, uh... Who was the mangaka for Dead Man Wonderland? Uh, Jinsei Ko... Tau... Uh, Tauka. Jinsei Ka... Katauka. Uh, what, what else have they done? What, did they... did they pass on? Copy... Uh, hold on. I'm looking them up now. Paste... Uh, 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 uh. My anime list, Jinsei Kataka. Dead Man Wonderland, Dead Man Wonderland. Well, it looks like the only thing they worked on was Dead Man Wonderland, but there was also another person on... Oh, damn it. Hey Patrick, did I ever tell you that I like um, occasionally like go on YouTube and actually, like watch streams of it? Like, oh hey, that was funny. Uh, what? Yeah, like I, I go to your YouTube videos and like rewatch. Oh, well, thank you. And j just so I can laugh at like the ridiculous interactions. Mm hmm. You know, and interact with the, you know, the two viewers that are there. Oh. I think I might have found, I think I might have found the thing that they, uh, basically left, uh, Dead Man Wonderland for. What was it? Uh, Eureka 7. Well, that's stupid. Like, I vaguely remember Eureka 7 being a thing, I just don't. Uh, yeah. I just don't I'm know actually, if it was actually new enough that it would, uh, interfere with it. Okay, fair enough. They really need to pick that up. Oh, you know what else needs to continue? Vagabond. That sounds familiar. It's, uh, it's a real thick samurai manga. That's not what I was thinking of. Um... You know what I think I you know what I think I was thinking of I was think I was thinking of uh, Vagabond Punk. Yeah, I've heard of it. Er, no, is it not called Vagabond Punk? What the fuck was it? No, Vag Vagabond is like samurai. Was I thinking of Sand Punk? Maybe. Desert Punk? Yeah, I was thinking of Desert Punk. I don't know why I my brain got that fucking crossed. We we really need to get you the bleach again, though. You know, saying that implies that I was into bleach at one point. Well, I mean, you watched it before, and now we're trying to get you to, uh, to watch it again. I mean, I was literally only watching bleach because my friends were watching it. Yeah, fair enough. Send a certain letter, or why don't you try talking to it? I don't get how you can watch all of One Piece, but not watch Bleach. Because I... <laughs> because I like One Piece. Yeah, but Bleach is way better. It's your opinion? Uh, yeah, but it's correct. I mean, do you really think One Piece is the best of the big three? Is it better than Naruto, in your opinion? Yeah, but I don't like Naruto. You don't like Naruto? Not really, no. Really? Why? I just found Naruto very... Uh, annoying. Is it because of the filler? Uh, and, I mean, I, I mean literally the main character, Naruto. Okay. You watch it sub or dub? Uh, I watched it dubbed. Like, I know yeah. everyone's like, watch the sub, not the dub. And it's just like, look. The dub was what no, I no, had no. access like, to I, as I've a kid. I've only ever watched it dubbed. I've actually never watched it dubbed, believe it or not. 
But I've heard I've heard a lot of people hate that dub specifically. Well, I, I think it's I think it's because they overdid the data bio. Uh you know? The what? Uh data bio is is um is basically uh Naruto's catchphrase. Oh, uh, believe it. Yeah, and they translated it into believe it and they made it this fucking annoying goddamn thing he spouted every five fucking seconds. But I think it's hilarious. You know what? I think I went to the wrong place. So, like, who do you think is stronger, Naruto or Sasuke? I mean, let's be honest. Naruto, it, it's not the show isn't called Sasuke, now is it? Yeah, but like even in the early days, like Sasuke was stronger. Um, I wish I took the B with me. Um. I mean, again, I, I, I've, I've never been that big of a fan of, uh, of, uh, Naruto, so I, you know, I have no, I have no horse in this race. Would you mind rewatching it? Like, like, how, how far did you get the first time? I think I got to the episode where he, um, where he meets Kanahamaru. Isn't that, like, the second episode? I think it's like the fifth. Um, oh, and then years later, Wait, where, where, then years later, I. What? Did you say beat or meat? Meat. Okay, I thought you said beat him. Um, but uh, years later, I watched the uh, the 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 ending of the series. Uh, not the movie, but uh, the. The, the Ninja War. Oh, I remember we were talking about this during Metal Gear Solid 2. Uh, we were talking about how they're making a sequel to Boruto. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like Saruto or something. And it's just like, this is literally a joke that ProZD made when, uh, when that fucking, uh, when fucking, uh, Burrito was coming out. Western checkpoint near Galapagos. Desperate to find. Someone sneaking into your bedroom? Uh, no, it's just uh, someone using the bathroom. Uh, the bathroom, like right next to your. It's like right across the hallway. Oh, okay. So it's like right next to me. Uh. I just love running into the monsters like that. Wow, do you actually earn like XP for doing that? Uh, nope. Oh, but it's just fun. It's just fun, yeah. Okay. It'd be really cool if you actually earn some. Wait, can you ride him off the cliff? Uh, no, no I don't cool. believe you can. No. Like, he started to go down, I was like real worried, like, oh god, can I? in Red Dead. Uh, oh, I am going the wrong way for this side mission. Oh, Patrick, um, I know it was early in the stream, but did you see the video I sent you earlier? Uh, I have not checked that out yet, no. Oh. Uh, Alright, well, check it out when you get it. Sure, sure. I think it was a video video about a baby donkey. Oh, that's cute. Have you ever been around one? Or? Uh, no, they're just, you know. I don't need to be around a, a creature to say that it's cute online. 
No, I, I was just curious if you ever had the opportunity to be around horses or any kind of farm life. You know what I just realized? We're back in Galopolis, so these people are from New Jersey. Greetings, traveler. My name's Hakeem. Please pardon my impertinence. But I assume you are making the, tri the journey to Gondolia. If so, I have a favor to ask you. Would uh, a favor I would like to ask you. I'm gonna give you an opportunity you can't refuse. I have a sister, you see. Her name is Akia. And she works she's in getting a... married. <laughs> she's getting married in three days. You need to ask my <laughs> father for a, for, a, for a favor. For a, fa for a favor. And she works in a bakery in the city. It seems she's been very busy of late. And has been unable really like to... to <laughs> Some fucking Stukats is making her work late. Uh, it seems she's been very busy as of late and has been unable to come home and visit as a result. As such, I have written her a letter. Unfortunately, I am not permitted to leave him a post. Would you be so good as to deliver the letter to Akia on my behalf? Yeah, go, 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 go take care of that gun, you know what I'm saying? You will? Oh, what? praise the Saiyans. Only one with truly kind heart would agree to assist a stranger in this manner. Here is the letter. I would like you to deliver. I do not... I do not need to tell you of this, of course, but its contents is very important. Do not lose it, please. Godfather wouldn't say please. Do not lose it, or else... Dons don't wear shorts. Dons don't wear shorts. Did you ever hear the story that uh, the guy from The Sopranos uh, had about that? Uh, no, let's, let's hear it. So, you know, it's like a month into the show premiering uh, on, on television. He gets a call at like 3 a.m. Uh, James Gandolfini. Um, he gets a fucking call at like 3 a.m. He's like, uh, 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 hello? What's, what's going on? And this person, he has no idea who the fuck they are, just replies, Hey, so, uh, I gotta say, I'm, uh, I'm a big fan of your show. It's, uh, it's pretty good, it's pretty good. Uh, one, one thing I wanted to talk to you about that, though. Dons don't wear shorts. Click. He's <laughs> like, The fuck? Fuck was that? Some random fucking mobster got James Gandolfini's phone number and called him up to tell him that that Dons don't wear shorts. Yeah. So 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 was that like made into a video like with this is like he, like yeah, he talked about it in an interview, and then they later used that, and then they later used that line in the show. Dons don't wear shorts. I think that's hilarious. Did, did he call back? Was it an unknown number? Or like... I, I, I think it, I think James Gandolfini like tried Star sixty nine, but like it wouldn't connect. Oh, so it, was, so it was like an unknown caller, too. Yeah. Was it on a landline or something, did you say? Uh, I think you said it was on a landline. Oh. Yeah, I was about to say, because if someone called me and I didn't see a number, I'm just like, nope. Well, I mean, he was also, like, half asleep at the time. Uh, uh, the key word, who yeah, I'd be the like, somebody had better, somebody had better die, you know? <sighs> but just like, he got better. called by an actual fucking mafioso in the middle of the fucking night just to tell him <laughs> Dons don't wear shorts. Okay, okay, I don't know how to say this without, you know, like, getting the wrath of the hammer down on, on us. Oh god. So I'm gonna try to where this is carefully as possible. Maybe don't say anything that the mob might take as some form no, no, of no, no. insult. 
no, 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 it has nothing to do with the mob. It has more to do with TikTok. Okay. Um. Well, actually, that would be really <coughs> funny if I pissed off the mob from a fucking dragon quest. <laughs> It'd just be like, hey, yo! We, we got a quest with dragon balls! I, I, I feel as though. <laughs> I, I mean, I guess really. Realistically speaking, if they were going to be offended by anything in my Dragon Quest playthrough, it would probably be more my accent during the entire time in Gundalia. <laughs> or in Galopolis. Yeah, but, yeah, but you're voicing people from New Jersey. Like, the mobs in... Well, first of all, there is no mob anymore, but... You know... Wink, wink, nut, nut. Yes, yes. No mob anymore, of course, no. There's no mob in New York. What are you talking about? Uh, where the fuck is the bakery? What? What, what murder? He was the greatest guy. What about the people he murdered? What murder? What murder? You, you, gotta, you gotta say it like a cheap. What, what murder? murder? Except, yeah. Uh, oh, hey, what the? You know who uh, Maria Medinos is? Who? Maria Medinos. I do not. Okay, look her up real quick and look up her laugh. Maria Menudos. Menunos. Menunos. Uh, the fuck she been in? Maria Menudos laugh. Is it weird that one of the first things that comes up when you type in her name is ethnicity? <laughs> you don't know who she is, or...? Uh, no. you ever go to a movie theater? Barely. Okay, you go to a movie theater, you watch a, you watch the trailers for the, uh... And she's, she hosts the uh, newbie. Hmm. video with her laugh? I, I did. This fucking Woody Woodpecker laugh. Yeah, she said she based it off goats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's something like that. And it's, I find it so funny that that's her natural laugh, too. Like, it's obnoxious, but it's just like... It's iconic. I'm shocked you don't know who this is, but you don't go to movies like ever. Yeah, nah. I very rarely go to movies. Oh, uh, this might be a bakery. Oh, hey, you're, you're the broad who uh, I had to deliver the letter to. Okay. Well, listen listen here, alright? Your, your, your brother's really worried about you, okay? No. Hey! Sorry, sorry. Akia, sorry, a letter from my brother? No, no, no. My name is Nokia, and I, I have an umbrella. Okay, so, Senora, see si, Akia worked here before, but she no finish finito. It's a shame. She's a talented baker, but she said to me she find a better job. A poop with a a boop or a bappy, a bappa boop a beep a bappa. There you go, you gotta throw those in while you read the thing. Allora, I see her today, just near the house with the doge. She seemed uh, to be uh, molto molto busy. A boop or a bappy, a scoopa. If you meet her with her, she said ciao from me. Oh my gosh. You know, that might get me in more trouble with the Mafia. <laughs> but it has nothing to do with them. Kit Colza? You know, that's, that's what you gotta name. The... How come you never named the episodes just something really obscure? Just like something like Dawn's Don't Wear Shorts. Well, maybe I'll, maybe I'll uh, <laughs> name this one that <laughs> Dawn's Don't Wear Shorts. like Dragon Quest Part 17. Don's don't worry. 
I really but, should put the, uh, the fucking, uh, the fucking part names again. I used to do that when I, uh, was doing, uh, like, daily you did, videos. You did but... that with Fatal Friend. Huh? You did that with Fatal Friend. Did I? I think so. I don't think I did. Um, hmm, you looking for a young lady named Akia? Well, my name is Akia. Do you think, do you think I might be the one you're looking for? Free hands over Akeem's letter. Oh, is this a letter from Akeem? A thousand thank yous. I shall read it, the, I shall read it right away. Let me see. My dearest Akia, my dearest Akia, are you well? I hope that your apprenticeship at, at the bakery is not proven to be too draining. I am certain that you will do well there. After all, you have always been such a hard worker, ever since you were a little goyle. Now that the misery of our old life is a thing of the past, I pray that you are enjoying your freedom. I cannot wait to see you blossom into a full-fledged baker. I have enclosed a few gold coins. Hopefully they will make the life a little easier for you. I very much hope to see you one day soon. And to taste one of your delicious cakes. One of your delicious cakes, if you know what I mean. Hey. Oh. Hey, forget about it. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So, what, what I was going to say don't earlier... fucking say that! <laughs> right. Uh, what's up? <laughs> you know what I'm tempted to do? What? Oh yeah, okay, so they actually have your number. Just like, uh, like, uh, put, put my number on the un no caller ID and just call you at like 3 o'clock in the morning and be like, Dawn, don't win. Come on. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, great. No. You say that, but usually by the by the time my stream ends, I'm usually, it usually is 3 a.m. <laughs> yeah, no, I know. I just call you like right after the stream ends. Dawn, don't win. Dawn, don't win. Shorts. No, 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 okay. It was it's like, God damn it. God damn it, Rock, I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> and, uh, and also, grab your Japanese man with mayonnaise and come downstairs. Go get your fucking shoe box. <laughs> Go get your fucking shine box. You what? Uh, it's a line from Goodfellas where uh, this one guy is uh, talking to Joe Pesci. Uh, and Joe Pesci's taking offense at what he's saying, and he's like, like, he's like, Joe, it's like Joe, or Tony, or whatever the fuck Joe Pesci's fucking character in that's called. If I wanted to insult you, I'd tell you to go get your, to go get your shine box. He's like, alright, alright, okay. Hey, now go get your fucking shine box, you motherfucker! <laughs> uh... Didn't that guy end up dying? Joe Pesci? No, the guy who said go get shine box. Oh, I mean, he was fucking old at the time. I can only imagine. No, I meant in the movie. Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't think I've ever actually watched uh, Goodfellas all the way through. Like, oh. most of them are dead by the end of the movie, actually. Yeah, that's true. Well, everyone except for, uh, Tommy. Yeah. I used to be a maid guy. Now I'm just a schnook. Yeah, no, it's, it's funny. Um, in this we need to, with all my love, Akeem. Oh, poor Akeem. How he must scrimp and save to, in order to send me money. I must write him my own letter in response. Wait a moment, please. It won't take long. Break weights. I realize that this is quite the imp imposition, but would you mind returning to the Western checkpoint and delivering this letter to Akeem? Eh, yeah, sure, fuck it, why not? I gotta get XP anyway. Also- Oh my god. You know, I, you know what I just pictured? This is how people used to text back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking have an errand boy running around. Just fucking, just fucking fantasy <laughs> version of the Pony Express. Yeah, yeah, just have a small African child running to back and forth. I mean, hey, it could be worse. You could be uh, a message slave 
in uh, ancient Rome. Like, did you ever... No. Like, I... Have you ever seen Horrible Histories? Uh... Probably once, but I haven't seen that episode. Uh, there was this, uh... Oh, it's this, it's this great British, uh... Like, kids show for, like, teaching kids, um, history and shit. And, like, they focus on really fucked up shit throughout history. And one of the things that and they... Were... for kids. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, I say fucked up, but, you know, it's, it's fucked up that's appropriate for kids. It's, like, gross and gory stuff. But again... Right, right. They, they, they never talked about, like, uh, like, in... Um... I think they actually do make a couple of of jokes about uh, certain royal families being inbred. Oh, okay. Um, but uh, oh, also the Egyptian uh, rulers. Um, but they they did this one sketch about uh, if you need uh, in ancient Rome, if you needed a uh, see to send a secret message. Uh, there are all kinds of ways to do it, like uh, ciphers that you wrap around a, 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 a cylinder and then roll it uh, across uh, a piece of paper with some ink, and it'll do that. And another way that they did it is by tattooing a message on the back of a slave's head and then letting that slave's hair grow out and then sending the slave to the person they send the message to. It's actually kind of smart. I mean, yeah, but it's certainly not fast. Uh, also, I very much appreciate if you did not tell my brother that I no longer work at the bakery. That is something I would like to tell him myself when the time is right. A thousand thank yous for your kind assistance, friend. May the sun smile upon you always. Uh, I think I'm gonna finish uh, this uh, this side quest, and then I'm gonna head to bed. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, so what's the stream for tomorrow? Well, whatever Wednesday. Uh, so yeah. eternal dark. Let's go. Um, there might be a slight hitch with that because I did look at the website that I download ISOs from, and I. Don't right. Eternal darkness. I don't see eternal darkness on there. Okay, time for you to buy it for two hundred fifty bucks. Fuck that. Yeah, no, I'm just no, 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 but okay, but I, I, I do want to get back to what I was saying that you know I'm gonna try to phrase it as carefully as I can. Uh, it's about JoJo part. Uh, or, uh, Golden Wind. Oh, Golden Experience, you know, yeah. What? Well, I mean, it's it's actually called Golden Experience. No, it's called Golden Wind. But isn't Golden Wind the name of uh, the American name for Golden Experience? It's called Golden Experience? Yeah. I've never heard it called that. Yeah, it's called Golden Experience because uh, it's it's another case of a of Iraqi um, uh, naming it after something specifically. I think it's a Prince album. So what? It, it couldn't be called Golden Experience. In yeah. US? Kind of weird, but okay. I mean, I mean, like, especially since it's fucking Prince, and Prince was incredibly litigious. Yeah. You know about the vault, right? The vault? Like a Disney vault? Is that what you think? Prince had an entire vault full of unreleased music, music videos, movies, that he spent, okay. that, you know, that he spent, like, all this money and effort and time and shit on, but, like, I guess it wasn't up to his standard, so he just never released it and never allowed anyone else to release it. Dick move. Yeah, kinda. Like, apparently, like, uh... 
Like, uh, Kevin Smith has this whole thing about how he worked for months with him to produce this one uh, music video. And on the last day, uh, you know, he was talking to uh, a teamster. And he was like, man, I can't wait to see this, uh, you know, on television. And the, the guy just says to him, yeah, that's probably never actually going to happen. And he, and he tells him about the vault. Okay, okay. So getting back to Golden Wind, right? Right. I'm get, uh, JoJo Part 4. Mm -hmm. Okay, so like all the characters are mafioso, but they look nothing like, you know, gangsters. Yeah, that, that season was, um... So the thing about Iraqis, the thing about Iraqis, um, character designs is that they're partially based off, like, their physical designs are based off of, like, um, Italian, uh, sculptures. All of their clothes... Yeah, but, like, but especially, like, Bucciarati. Yeah. Like... He, he looks absolutely ridiculous. He looks like a woman. I mean, let's be entirely honest. They... Oh no! Wait, I, I got, I got in trouble once for uh, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thinking. Don't, 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 yeah. don't say the T word. Yeah. Um. But like. Yeah, like all the clothes in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is based off of like Italian fashion shows and the like. Okay. But, like, something I really like, and I think is really cool, uh, Jotaro's, like, Hey, clothes. Asian Bank 7! What's up, my man? Sorry, I, I, I didn't see you, I didn't see your, uh, comment uh, before. How's it going, Asian Banks? Um. And, of course, you know, he, he chooses the fucking weirdest shit. Of course, and again... That might just be, frankly, the things he's choosing. Uh, actually, if you've seen a fashion show recently, he might actually be choosing the more normal clothes there. Yeah, actually, like, I have no idea, like, anything about fashion. So, like, if I if I walked out in public wearing JoJo clothes, like, would I get weird looks? Depends so, look on... Which arc? Part three. I think people could easily pull off part three clothes. Like, part three clothes weren't that weird. Like, you know, Paul Narafs was a little odd, but I mean, you know, he's French, so, you know. No, I, I meant, like, yeah. It's going good, brothers. Just had a couple of drinks. Like, 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 ah, like, like, nice. No, I, well, what about Dio's clothes, part three? I mean, Dio's clothes is ostensibly just, you know, uh, a pants, you, you know. His isn't, again, his is not that out there. It's just, you know, it's it's a it's a black A-shirt, uh, a jacket, a headband, uh, and matching pants, and a, uh, a belt. Now I'm chilling with y'all. Good to hear it, man. Oh, uh, what do you do for work, uh, Asian Banks? Hey, Patrick, remember that one time you stayed up, like, till, s till six? With, uh, with me and Movie Monkey? Yeah. That was hilarious. Yeah, it took us like four hours to watch like 15 minutes of video. Oh, damn. Oh, the, oh military police slash air force. Oh, that's cool. Thanks for the, Thank you for your service. Yep, thanks for your service, man. Also, uh, Pat Patrick accepts gifts, especially for military uh, members. In case you were wondering. Ten years serving, thanks for the support. 
Actually, I think it's a requirement that military uh, members must give to Patrick. What the fuck? I'm just, I'm just fucking with. I thought that would be funny. Oh. Hey, Whoa. movie monkey like from one of my videos. Oh, hey. Wait, he, he's awake right now. I guess. Uh. Oh, you have returned. Did you see my sister? How is she? Is she well? Say no, say no, say no. Oh god, I should've. Uh... Oh! Is this... It is! A letter from my dearest Akia. A thousand thank yous for bringing it to me. I cannot wait to see what it says. Uh, it would've been really funny. Is she doing well? And I just walk away. It's like... The, the hell, man? That didn't answer my question. What's wrong with my sister? She's pregnant. Oh, God. She's pregnant. No, with no, Cosby she's dead. Hey, she's pregnant uh, and dead. Oh, God. With Bill Cosby's kid. Oh, God. Who? <laughs> He just goes like, who? Because he's just got no context for who the fuck Bill Cosby is. Oh, okay. Uh. Dear Akeem, I received your letter. Thank you. Thank you also for the money. I know that I cannot... Oh. What? Oh, I... Fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God, Asian Bank 7. What the fuck? Hashtag... <sighs> bro Don't bro say bro it out loud. What, what, what does that mean? I refuse to elaborate. I, I've never heard this term. No, I'm I, like I'm serious. Like, welcome to the person that just joined. Welcome to this insanity. I say, bro. Uh, I received your letter. Thank you. Thank you for the money. I know that it cannot be easy for you to help s support us both. If it were not for your assistance, I would be unable to follow my dream of becoming a baker. I am learning so much here. Only the other day, my master mentioned he much how much I had Oh, improved. okay. Okay, okay, I think he was trying to say Ruth. Okay. Is that not how you spell that? No, it's, it's just, you know, like, I can't read it in my life, so I, I didn't. Huh. I, I, I started reading it. Hey, as welcome people in chat. Uh, uh, all I, I was reading it as Rowfield. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck is Rowfield? I was I was reading it as Donald Rumsfeld. Yeah, uh, but... I will continue to, to work on uh, Akeem. I want you to be proud of me. With all my love, Akia. Aha! Dear little sister, Akia, she sounds as though she is doing well and working wait, wait, hard. Pat What's up? Patrick, you see... You see that mountain behind him? Does that not look like a face? I mean, it doesn't like, look like, like one to me. Like like a little frown face, the nose, the two eyes are the shadows, and then like a headband. I mean, it kind of looks like a Geo dude, I guess. Geo dude. Yeah, from Pokemon. Oh yeah, I guess I kind of see that. Yeah. Hmm. I got you, bro. If you look at it that way. Uh, in truth, life has not been easy for her. Our father did not treat us well. He was once a kind and gentle man, but then he suffered a terrible injury, which made him horribly bitter. Aki and I would often bear the brunt of his frustrations. It was not a pleasant environment in which to grow up, which is why I want to ensure that she can enjoy her life now that she is free of it. Now that he may or may not be at the bottom of the sea. Uh, Haleta has brought me great relief. I am indebted to you for your delivering it to me. Please, accept this by way of thanks. Ooh, now I can make battle well, I'm not forks. echoing, am I? Patrick, can you still hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. What's up? Am I echoing? 
Not really. Anyway, uh, I think I'm gonna head off for tonight. Thank you guys for for being here tonight. Um, well, can, can, can I say my goodbyes? Yeah, go ahead. All right, avocados from Mexico, and uh, also uh, Patrick. What's up? We'll always have Paris. Ah, uh, yes. Hey, Night Asian Bank Seven. Okay, let me just uh, co-host. What the fuck is that? Huh? Can't wait to cause more chaos on the stream tomorrow. Uh, there it goes. Oh, nice. Good to hear it, Asian Bank 7. Um, mind if I just call you Banks, by the way? It's always a bit of a mouthful. Thanks, Banks. Um, anyway, that's going to be it for tonight. Uh, thank you guys so much for joining and hanging out with me during, during this. Um... If y'all are watching this on uh, on TikTok, please consider following the channel to stay up to date with all the streams I do throughout the week, plus little D&D &D sketches and the occasional clip from the streams. Um, thanks, Banks. Sounds wrong. Thank you, Banks. Um... If you're watching this on YouTube, please consider liking, commenting, subscribing, sharing, and dinging the bell. All that really helps out the channel lets me know that you guys are enjoying the content that I'm putting out when you say it fast. Eh, fair enough. Uh, if you are watching this on YouTube, there should be an end card at the last 20 seconds of the video with three links on it. One to my YouTube channel, one to uh, the Dragon Quest XI uh, playlist, uh, and one to a video YouTube thinks you'll like. Uh, consider checking out the Twitch channel that gets exclusive streams of its own. In fact, earlier tonight, I continued my playthrough of Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. Um, consider checking out... Oh, thanks for the heart. Thanks for the heart, Rock. Um, consider checking out the Patreon, where currently uh, you can uh, pay a small fee of three dollars to add a game to the wheel of wednesday which is how i normally choose the game for the uh whatever wednesday streams um any ideas on what games we're doing tomorrow uh well we're definitely playing some uh we're definitely playing what time y'all getting back on uh uh midnight tomorrow on tiktok um and eight o'clock uh, or 8 p.m. on uh, Twitch. Um, and my brain. Uh, you can pay three dollars to add a game to the Wheel of Wednesday, uh, which is how I've been choosing the games for the Whatever Wednesday streams. Um, and for a small monthly donation of two dollars a month. You'll get access to uh, some perks, uh, like the uh, the Discord server and an entry into a monthly raffle for a free uh, addition to the Wheel of Wednesday, and uh, access to a podcast when I finally get around to doing that. Boy, do I know how to make something sound enticing. Um, anyway, um... If there's not a link directly to any of the things that I've mentioned, there should be a link on my uh, page to my link tree that does have a link to anything, to everything. Um, and thank you guys so much for watching. I'll hopefully see you guys next time. Mm, bye. Patrick, get ready for a chess match tomorrow. Oh, God. Anyway. Bye, guys. <laughs>